Hi backers, my name is James Townley and I'm working on the software. Today we're going to talk about where that software has uh, come over the last little while and where we plan on taking it from here. Since the last update we've made quite a bit of progress on removing a lot of the bugs and problems from the software. Our primary focus right now is making that software more robust and making the prints that come out of that software even better by compensating for things that we see in the environment and with the printer. One of the things we found with the prints is often there's a period right before each layer where that laser turns off just a little too soon. So what we've done is we've compensated for that by having an overlap fe feature. So what that lets you do is it lets you specify how many millimeters overlapping the previous layer you want to travel. Another thing we've done is add the ability to shuffle your layer starting points. So as you go through all of your layers, you may not want to start in the same point because there's always a little bit of an artifact when we start printing, just like an FDM printer or a PLA printer. Uh, those artifacts exist for us too with the laser. So by staggering those starting points over many, many layers, those uh, artifacts seem to disappear. So that's another ability we've added. One of the things we're working on improving right now is the whole user experience for the software. So making it a lot easier to use and making the steps required to get your printer set up and printing it even less. So one of the things we're going to do is we're going to take the uh, software and allow you to use the mouse to drive around that point when you're calibrating. So we're going to say go to a specific point, you drive the mouse there and you click on it and then you're going to be done. We're going to be able to take a large sample set of those points and glue them all together to come up with a really well calibrated printer. You may have noticed that we're in a bit of a different location today and the reason for that is we wanted to be able to move our software closer to our development and our hardware and our packaging. So I decided to move from the uh, other location to this location so I could be closer to a lot of the action and see the problems as they're coming up so that I could better deal with them with the software. Really having a great time working on the software and trying to get that peachy printer making those perfect prints that we hope to see. I'm glad you're all waiting patiently for those to come and I can't wait to deliver a product to you.